Good morning, fans, Privateer FX. Coming at you 27 January. Um, not much to talk about on a very light morning here in Europe. We like Aussie lower uh, and gold lower in the European session. Aussie <laughs> trading here at 97. It's just dipping below the figure now. Probably going to be some risk below 70, 80 uh, in Aussie. If we quickly look at the gold chart, you can see this guy's leaning left as well. Market's very long gold. Um, below 1918. Should be some risk. We're probably going to clear this stuff out before we get to the core PCI price index, which is uh, 2.30 Swiss time. This is a super important number because the Fed has said over and over again, this is their key metric. Um, we're accepting we're expecting positive 0 0.3 if that thing comes in hot dollar goes higher stocks go lower if that comes in soft dollar goes lower stocks go higher uh, so it's kind of a binary moment at 230 you don't want to head into 230 with a with uh, a packet of dollar positions on um, that's usually not uh, such a sensible idea what else is out there um, markets Rates are higher. Um, we were fishing for low ones down at 340. We did not get given. That's selling high ones in the treasury. Um, greedy, I guess. Uh, now we're higher, so we really didn't get paid on that this week. Uh, crude also on its highs. Market is slowly getting itself very, very long crude in the high 80s, in the high 70s and low 80s here. Typically not a good sign. Um, we're looking to fade some crude, uh, even though the GDP numbers were good. Just positioning and psychology of this market in particular. Um, people tend to get long at the tops, short at the lows. Um, we're going to try and sell on the 82 handle between probably 82. 60 and 8360 if we see it today so it's still far away but something to keep in mind euro not doing anything what's going to happen here i don't know are we going to make some new lows and and test that uh 3540 level where we saw that big institutional money um on i guess what was that tuesday uh perhaps um i don't know is this going to head lower in Europe and then we're going to get a soft PCI and close at 109.50? Uh, that seems like a pretty, con that pretty compelling story uh, as, far as, as far as I know. Um, again, you can't go into core CPI with a big chunk on. So let's just see. Um, but it looks like she wants to lean left here at the open. Cable, not doing anything. We still have this 124, uh, 46 level double top up here. I'm sorry, 124, 56. Uh, could that break today if we get a soft uh, PCI, PCE? Uh, yes, it could. Uh, if you are short and looking for the double top, you certainly have a better average now. You probably traded this in a round. Obviously, you just got to stick your stop above that. Um, you know, and then be patient, right? Like the double top, the neckline on this is 118.47. So um, be, be very, very patient if you're preempting uh, the double top. Euro Swiss, it's been a buy on dip all week, so you want to wait for low ones. Yesterday, the lows came in the 90s. Today, also probably somewhere between 70 and the figure, you want to scoop up some Euro Swiss. This is going to remain bid, I think. In the European session, if Euros go lower, this probably might head a bit lower as well. Not a whole heck of a lot more to say. Let's just bring up this dollar China. Whoever was at 679 won. Um, they keep winning over and over and over again. This is now a break trade at 679.50. I know that's fairly anathema to a lot of you who don't, don't understand how to buy high ones and leave a tight stop. 
Um, but I don't care. Um, just talking to myself here. But for now, uh, whoever the monster is up there at 679, he's one. Here we are, lower. And if we get a low one in PC today, this is gonna this is gonna go further down. Again, I don't want to belabor this uh, with the sound of my voice here. Not much to do um, in the European morning here. Just get ready and get yourself uh, sorted for um, a fun afternoon that's going to be quite binary on the release of that number. Um, anyway, that's all I got. Uh, good luck to you all today. Have a good weekend. I'll catch you on Monday. Ciao.